Have you guys heard about this? Governor Andrew Cuomo of New York is going to win an Emmy for his daily briefings on the novel coronavirus. I swear we went from only winners getting trophies to everyone getting a trophy to now only the losers getting a trophy. It really shows you just how far we've fallen as a society. New York has had the most COVID deaths by far, and the left celebrate their governor as the example of what to do. His policies killed thousands of senior citizens, and now he's going to get an Emmy for telling us about it in his daily briefings? It's all kind of upside down, isn't it? The CEO and president of the International Academy of Television, Arts, and Sciences, Bruce Paisner, said, quote, The governor's 111 daily briefings worked so well because he effectively created television shows with characters, plot lines, and stories of success and failure, unquote. Ironically, the failures were Cuomo's policies, and the successes came from President Trump providing ventilators and thousands of extra hospital beds, beds that would have saved a lot of lives had they been used. Instead, the governor just sent COVID-positive patients directly to the weakest and most vulnerable people of New York, which led to the state having the worst COVID statistics in America. But I guess it made for good TV. I'm sure glad the Academy could see through all the death and despair to enjoy Cuomo's policy failures that shortened the life of thousands of New York's oldest residents. Of course, Cuomo won't own up to the fact that it was his policies that put COVID-positive patients in nursing homes. And if you go to a leftist fact-checking site like PolitiFact, it backs him up and says that this claim is mostly false. But check out what it also says in their article. Quote, Cuomo has been dogged by criticism for months over his March advisory directing nursing homes in the state to accept patients who had or were suspected of having COVID-19. As long as they were medically stable, the notice said, it was appropriate to move patients in. Further, nursing homes were prohibited from requiring that medically stable prospective residents be tested for the virus before they arrived. Between March 25th and May 8th, approximately 6,326 COVID-positive patients were admitted to nursing homes, according to a state health department report. Unquote. But yeah, it's mostly false. Putting 6,000 virus-infected people into nursing homes didn't really have anything to do with other nursing home residents catching COVID-19. They probably caught it from their grandkids, who they could only visit with, staring out of a window. Sorry, was I upside down? I've been spending too much time researching the left. I'm sure you remember when former President Barack Obama won the Nobel Peace Prize for doing absolutely nothing, while President Donald Trump actually brokered peace in the Middle East and got mocked for it. But that's just how things are in the upside-down world of the left. A world where Dr. Fauci, the director of the National Institute of Allergy and Infectious Diseases, praised Governor Cuomo and New York as having done it correctly when it comes to stopping the spread of COVID-19. Let me remind you that for about a six-week stint, New York put a 1,000 COVID-positive patients a week into nursing homes that led to thousands of deaths. And somehow, they're celebrated as having done it correctly by Dr. Fauci. And as being a good television drama by the Academy. So good that it's going to win an Emmy. Andrew Cuomo did exactly what you would do if you wanted to kill the most people possible. I guess that's a plot line and those grieving the premature death of their parents and grandparents or characters? Was it all created for the enjoyment of those watching his daily briefings on TV? It sounds like the Academy thinks so. <laughs> Boy, the left really do live in an upside-down world. And that's the simple truth. Thanks for watching. If you like this video, subscribe to our channel. And if you want to become a supporting member of Blue Collar Logic, Click on the link in the description and give what you can.